What Bangkok is doing right, thanks in part to the great 100 Resilient Cities team, is applying data and analytics to understanding where people are most vulnerable, focusing on those communities and coming up with strategies to help them move out of poverty and protect themselves from climate threats in the future. We saw families living in extreme poverty. The project we visited was very exciting because they have moved 50,000 people, 12,000 families, from those types of conditions into proper, modern, clean, and safe housing. It can sometimes sound so conceptual, climate resilience, but when you meet the families who benefit from living in better conditions, you really get a feel for the human impact. How are you? You good? Awesome, look at you. The history of the Rockefeller Foundation's partnerships in Thailand is just extraordinary. We have been working with Siri Raj Hospital and Medical Center for more than 100 years and have used that partnership to really introduce modern science-based medicine and public health to Thailand and now throughout the region. Well, the urban challenges in Katajin are, are really about a very diverse, very old community coming together. It's a great example of very good urban planning uh, coming together across racial and ethnic differences and uh, Rockefeller's support for active community participation in urban redesign. Well, what's really striking about Thailand is the very long, very deep, and very respectful partnership the Rockefeller Foundation has had with uh, Thailand. It's a reminder uh, that sometimes great change and great progress takes time, and being committed for the long run to each other can really help lift up so many different people and communities.